So, today's video is all about Hocus Pocus. Again! are new hey girl hey make sure you click on that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll always be up to date with my latest tutorials so let's just drop the bomb if you watch my last video you're already gonna know that I wore this outfit already and the reason being is because I filmed both these videos in the same day. So just pretend like I'm wearing a different outfit because I literally didn't feel like changing, seriously. <laughs> so in this video, obviously, um, this week is Hocus Pocus themed because my last video, if you have not seen that yet, was Hocus Pocus themed as well. So go ahead and check that out after you watch this one if you haven't watched the previous one and today in this video we're just going to be making a hocus pocus sign that you can put up anywhere in your home for a party that you're doing whatever you want to do this sign is so simple to make and it's super cute by the way so let's get started the main materials you're going to need for this project are one hocus pocus banner one one by two by eight board one four by four piece of plywood and sawtooth hangers so the first step is to remove the string from the words. So now I'm just going to place the words into the plywood and I'm going to use my leveler and I am going to draw a line to where I want to cut the wood. So after I've got my line drawn, I'm just going to come over to my table saw and cut the portions off that I don't need. And again, if you do not have a table saw or a circular saw, you can definitely take the wood that you have purchased from Lowe's or Home Depot and they will cut the wood for you. Now I didn't show myself cutting the one by two board, but I will have all these measurements down below if you wanna use the same ones. And this is what it looks like after everything is framed up before we stain. So now I'm gonna to start to stain the plywood and first I'm putting down weathered oak and then I'm gonna to top it with dark walnut. Now I'm just gonna take my black chalk paint and I'm gonna spray the one by two boards. So now that everything has dried, I'm gonna to start to nail the one by two boards. If you don't have a nail gun, you can always do this using wood glue and E6000. So now I'm gonna come inside and I'm gonna to start to arrange my words. So I'm just gonna keep my words in the center like this, but there's several different ways you can do this. So you can push the word hocus to the top, have pocus at the bottom, put something on the sides there. You can put hocus on the top, pocus on the bottom, and draw something on the sides or add something on the sides. Or you can just push the words up and add something at the bottom. So now I'm gonna add the words to the plywood using spray adhesive. So now the last step is to add the sawtooth hanger. So I'm just gonna eyeball where the center is. Now you can add a sawtooth hanger or you can just have this as a standalone, um, but it's up to you. I'm just adding a sawtooth hanger and after that, it's gonna be ready to hang. All right, so that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below in the comments and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.